everyone, welcome back to my channel, and if you're new here, welcome for the first time. I'm finally coming around to do a playthrough of the demo of the Heliotrope Chronicles book 1 after seeing on the idea for a month, so it got released. I'm so sorry I didn't get to do that on Sunday. Something personal came up and I wanted to take my mind off of it, which is good timing because the background music is quite relaxing. So, let's have Roger grab his crystal tomahawk, get out of bed, and take his head in the swamp.
most of you know my top my scale expertise and program sucks. And that's also the sadly that's also the reason why I why I would have to move further with the moving platform because if you just stand still he's gonna eventually fall off. Final area on the level before the boss fight. The boss takes place. The exit is blocked by a giant keyhole. Giant keyhole. That can only be unlocked that I, by a skeleton key that Anthony was kind enough to design. We, we, we can't really see it very well, but it's on one of the floating platforms that's not moving. A really great job with that. Aside from Chubbo and GT Classic Avatars, I wanted to thank him for helping me out. For helping me out lately. Really. Exemplary knowledge of the dark and 
that noise could have been caused by anyone with exemplary knowledge of the Dark Arts. A wizard whose power over the Earth is also second to Gia's could have tried to trick you. You would have disappeared. We've been over this dozens of times, Freddy. I'm not a damsel in distress waiting to happen. I can take care of myself. You should know that perfectly well by now. Don't worry so much about me. Consider the state you're in before you look out for others. Couldn't help but do, do just that because I care about you. You all chose to run away with me when the danger only was absolute. What else are friends there for? We have to rely on each other now more than ever. Yet, yeah, the others could be anywhere, Sophie. The farther we search, the farther apart they appear to be. That's the thing. Appearances can be deceptive. It's another piece of advice you should have heard memorized. We'll find them. We don't have any clue where they are, where they might be, or if they were to work. But, are you really going anywhere by second guessing yourself? If you can stand your ground against the father of the Dark Lord and live like you did just a few seconds ago, you're capable of overcoming any obstacle. Remember that. That words bring you to your knees, that's all. Yes, let's get moving. Our friends are going to come around if we stand here and lament what could have been. Did you hear yourself? You finally admitted this cage was all in your head and I'm so proud of you. Sometimes I forget I can be brave if I wanted to be. Then remind yourself more often than you are, that you are, Frederick. You have the power to fight for this. I believe in you. You did I do. This is a dream. Stage clear. After knocking down a rude Dracul cultist, Frederick was reunited with his childhood friend, Ethel. The friends are still lost in the woods, and this encounter is just the beginning of what they've gotten inside. Well, Now we have the staff credits. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please leave a like and subscribe to this channel. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye!